I could talk on and on about my research experience here, coming from a background of someone who had never done research before in a more complicated sense, of course. The benefits of doing research at Mayo is that you have unlimited resources. We have statisticians, we have librarians, we have poster makers, we have people that will edit your paper to make sure that the language is correct and grammatically correct. That is not found anywhere else, at least not for residents. So that allows you to do more high quality research and learn. Um, I've learned how to do a systematic review, which I hadn't known before, but the librarian took the time to help me do that and now I can do it. And so having all those resources has been very beneficial. Um, a lot of other programs don't support residents financially to do research and go to conferences and that's a big barrier. You need the time off, which we have. You need the funding, which we have. Um, and that allows you to go and meet other people and collaborate and obviously make Mayo proud, but also uh, benefit your own academic journey. So one of the cool things about Mayo Clinic is how much um, emphasis we put on research and innovation and how it's not just in the lab um, with you know basic science, but that's actually translated into our clinics and we can take part of trials um, and register patients in trials. Um, and you feel like you're a part of what could be a therapy that changes the world. And someday you can go back and say, oh yeah, that procedure that was invented at Mayo when I was resident, I was one of the first people to take part of that procedure.